This is Doc and Duane from Paddling Profits. All right, we decided uh, we are taking we file, cabinet. file cabinets and we are going to rearrange and use them instead. And so he'll show you why in our inventory. That's what we're doing uh, this weekend. We have these junky ones that we could put a bin on. Standard 18 gallon or a little bit wider. These are about three foot. And everything that was on this rack up to the ceiling, we just got into this right here. And there's a couple more things that would fill up to here, but this is only 18 inches. This is half the space. Half the space, everything is going to fit in the same areas here. We have two more racks back there that we got to move right now. And we should get the four racks that are right here, we should get them into a six foot space and then save all that room. We had what, 18 quart we have in? How many 18 bins? 20s. We figured the 18 quarts fits in these here. And then what's going to happen is once we put these together, um, this side and the other side, we then have, we'll have a storage. We've got eight of them to yeah, start with. Yeah, eight to start with. And then we'll have this area here. Across. Across to be flat. We'll, be show flat. You, we'll show the you here. Large yard is on top. Yeah. But the little or, or else another set of uh, two file cabinets on top of them. And go all the way to the ceiling then. With all drawers. But we need room for big stuff too though. The file cabinets for 10 a piece. The two tall cabinets. For 20 a piece and the other one there for three. This steel cabinet, that was three dollars. I can't see what I'm doing here. Adjustable. It's adjustable. And we got this this shelving. Uh, now these are not Hans. I don't know who made these. Let me see if I can get them. Can't see them recording because it's so bright out. But yeah, they're adjustable, and this pulls out. Goes in. Twenty dollars a piece for these. Three dollars for this one, which I wish you had more of those. Eight Hans for ten. So to pick these up, cheap or on Craigslist, let go. You know, pretty cheap. Sometimes you see them on the curb, but we wanted kind of matching. And we, we couldn't beat the deal. They go all the way up. We have one or two of them. This one doesn't, but we're, we're still able to put our product in there pretty good. We can always rig something up and put something in there to make the sides all the way up, but for the most part, we pretty much don't need it. You don't want them too, anything too full anyways. It's just like with bins, you get, get it too full, you got to pull everything out. You can't find anything. I like the idea of not pulling the bin off the shelf, setting it down, going through it. I just open the drawers up. And, uh, and also adjust. Yeah, they, they adjust as well. Like that, the divider. And then you also have the uh, opportunity of locking them too. Like you see here. Uh, the place we got them didn't have keys, so they put tape on it so they didn't get locked. But yeah, we got to peel that off. There, there's a number on there. You can get, you can get keys. And we'll show you the end result. At the beginning of the video, we had two rows. We had two racks, and they were from here to here. And that's about five and a half feet. And they came down to about here, which is six feet, four foot by six foot. So we freed up a foot this way, and freed up all this space here. And those two racks, everything that was in those two racks is in those front four drawers. Like these. These are all empty. And then we got the miscellaneous stuff up on top. And we just put these here to show that you could you could ha actually add more. Right now there's 32 drawers. And we had, and it held about I don't know, maybe 16 bins plus this, 18 quart bins plus a little extra on every shelf. So now we've got it all consolidated down and it's all in these front four file cabinets. This, so it actually shrunk the space 
it more almost tripled the amount of items we can get in here. Because on this whole side, all this space here, you can still use, which is about three of these drawers high. And we gained another foot. So if you're tight on space, try these uh, cabinets out. They're um, 18 inches, 18 inches wide. 25 deep, well about 26 or 27 with the handle, and 52 tall, and then you get a nice big wide space up on top to stack bigger items. Yeah, we could fit uh, two, four, six, eight, another 16. Bins if we wanted to go with bins. But yeah, if we wanted to go to bins on top, or bigger. We could get double file cabinets, put them up on top have a step to get in them but yeah. who knows yeah we're thinking about the double we're not sure we kind of like the flat area for the bigger items too but it consolidates your space a lot yeah we just in increase we're getting so full we need, we need to find a different way to organize some of our shelves and this is what we started with so and we were going to get the metal with the, the metal racks with, with the, the wheel. wheels and all that for like from amazon they're like 50 60 bucks five foot long but you're still going to run into the same problems as those same crappy metal shelves that we have so you're not going to be able to, you're not going to use that whole space as good best as you can right i don't like the lip on them either don't all have lip. yeah not all of them have the lip but so it's a suggestion like i said today we woke up and there was two that were free but we're trying to organize all our inventory from all the stuff we've gotten lately and the bigger cabinets we have behind us uh we really comes consolidated and then um, we'll probably put these on casters, two, put two sets together, put them on locking swivel casters. That way we can move these out of the way easy. Right now we just got them in. If we wanted to move one of these right now, we wouldn't even really need to empty it. Just put a hand truck under it, pull back on the handle, and we could pretty much go. We don't have a lot of super breakables in, in there. Yeah. Like I said, this could work for not just in a garage, it could work in your home. Uh, you can have a, if you don't like the idea of a black or brown or cabinet, uh, they have ways to, to redo them for your um, home, match your home decor. There's a bunch of videos on YouTube on how you can um, repurpose them for the colors you want. But like I said, I, I, I like it. I'm glad that, that I thought about it. We'll be able to trip up our space. Um, easily, easily. Yeah. So that's what we're uh, that's what we're gonna do. Uh, so we're far, not, we're not matching our home decor. Yeah, we're not matching our home decor. We do we do like to have the black this out here. This is here. This will probably always be here. <laughs> we don't care. No, it won't because I don't like it because everything's all Whatever. nice and neat. <laughs> but on the other side, we've got labels that say A1, A2, A3, A4, yeah. like that. Well, we always did that system. And, yeah. Well, it's, instead it's of bands, there. yeah. Yeah, so the bends, you know, A through one, you know, and then we have a flat file that we do, and the larger cabinets. We're still working on getting those in, but this is the first bunch that we have in. I like it. I'm glad uh, Doc figured out how much we can actually put into a, each drawer, and it's nice. You don't have to lift that left up. All right, it's not to consider. Like and subscribe if you want to see more videos, and if you don't, then hit the down button, thumbs down button.